Okay, so I got the panels off the machine so we can kind of see inside a little bit to look at some of the features and you know what I consider are the, some of the really good things that's, that's done on this machine. So you can see that it's got a, a solid a steel frame construction and then the panels that come off really easy. So it makes it really easy for any kind of maintenance or if you ever had to do any kind of repairs on this. Um, your pump uh, and motor assembly is right here, easily accessible. That's something you really should never have to service, but you never know. Um, if you look over here, one of the, the big features of this machine is it has an insulated uh, tank for the, the test oil. Um, I've worked with a lot of machines that just kind of had a sump, maybe they were a sheet metal thing and you had oil in there and then just a heating element. And the problem with them, it's kind of like when you go into an old house, you know, you don't have a good uniform heating in there. You know, go into an old house and if the furnace runs, it's warm where the air blows out, but you get over by the walls or even by the windows, you can feel the breeze coming through. Same thing with the tank, you know, having this insulated tank like this is going to keep that oil at a uniform temperature. The heater's not going to have to work as hard, um, and it's just, it's, it's a really good practice to do. Um, so that's a really nice feature they have there for that. Um, the other thing that's really a nice feature about this is just the feet on this. It's got adjustable feet uh, that pivot a little bit on the bottom and have rubber on there. So it's going to kind of stick in place. Uh, you can adjust them to different heights. So if the spot you're putting it isn't completely level, you can level the machine. Um, and you can raise this up, uh, I think it's a little over, over an inch, so an inch from, this is kind of set right now, is at the lowest position, I can still bring this up, so you can kind of level that uh, to whatever you're, you're working on, so that's some kind of some nice features there. Uh, I'm going to spin the machine around now, and we'll kind of look at the back where all the electrical and the hydraulics are.